Shut up. <laughs> I have to promote myself on Twitter from from now on in instead of being a wimp Saying I'm live, but the little thing isn't popping up, which is weird. I mean, everything's working. So, like, I guess there's no harm in it. Also, I'm, like, way too close to the TV for it to be this loud. Anyways, uh, did I... Go to your server too. <laughs> okay. I mean, I know we have basically the same people, but they're more active in your server. <laughs> Who said you could stop the nice music? Ew. <laughs> we use this dashboard. There we go. Aha! I caught this thing in the act. The Twitch, for some reason, keeps taking the categories off my video or off my streams, and like. It makes sure that nobody can, like, search for stuff like Kingdom Hearts and stuff to even find me, so that sucks. <laughs> but, wait a second, are you, are you watching? I swear I hear myself in the background. <laughs> huh, weird. Yeah, maybe I am hearing things, huh? Hmm, weird. Anyways, time to properly do this. Hello, how you doing everyone? Here we are once again. Back at it with that. That kingdom of hearts. Yeah. No, stop it. I like the nice music. <laughs> Hello, Square Enix. How you doing? It's been a while. 
Load game. Alright. Let's see what I'm doing. You are heard. I mean, you should be. I mean, I I would expect it. My speaker on my phone is like right up against my uh microphone, so. Chia. What do you want from me? Well, you weren't supposed to have a comeback like that, but. Anyways, whole uh, Atlantica. Okay, so yeah, yeah, now I'm starting to remember. Yeah, in the last episode, we did one thing that I really hated, which was Atlantica. I did not have fun exploring that place, honestly. Sorry, fans of Little Mermaid, your world sucks. It's so weirdly laid out. Eh. It was mainly Ursula that got to me. I really did not like her boss. She just like... I don't know. It was very awkward of a boss, but whatever. Uh, Halloween Town? Of course I loved that one. I love Nightmare Before Christmas. It's like one of my favorite Disney movies. One of my it's my favorite Tim Burton movie in general, like I love that one. Yes, Wait, Jalen, have you watched Nightmare Before Christmas? Yes, I have. Sweet. Good. We will watch it together anyway. <laughs> God, that, that it's such a nice movie. And yes, I, I do happen to know many of the songs, and I may have sang to them multiple times. Jalen may have heard me all those multiple times. It was, so, here, let me set it out for you guys. Last Halloween, I usually watch the movie every Halloween. So I was watching it, of course, last Halloween. 2020, and since I was stuck inside, you know, my parents went off to someplace. They, they, they went to my aunt and uncle's house for, like, some party or something. I didn't want to go because I enjoy being home alone. Because it's fun. <laughs> That's basically that part of the story. Anyway, uh, so I had Jalen on the phone and I said, Okay, well, got nothing else to do, so it's time. And then I turned on Nightmare Before Christmas and I sang along with basically every song. And that was awesome. Yeah, she was drawing the entire time. Oh my god. She's plaguing my streams. It's just this one stream.
you know, one of the many that you have invaded. <laughs> What the heck is that thing? <laughs> I'm still kind of disappointed that Monstro wasn't a fight for the... wasn't like a boss for the gummy ship. It would actually make, you know, flying through dimensions a little more fun. You're glitching out. Not anymore. Indeed. Also, this level for the gummy ship is taking forever. I'm just gonna hold down the shoot button. This is how you play Star Fox. <laughs> Never actually completely played Star Fox. I tried the first level, and then I, I just like couldn't really get too much of a hang of it. Hey, Goofy. Uh, a big sheep is catching up to us. <laughs> Look ahead. <hate. laughs> uh, oh, Pirates of the Caribbean. Quit gawking! It's a pirate ship. going to ram us, hold on tight, uh... Why did I say Pirates of the Caribbean? That's not what I meant. What is this? Uh, Peter Pan. Yep, Neverland. There we go. The moment I saw a pirate ship, like, that was... Caribbean was the first thing I thought of. It's another movie come, my sister Sora. was obsessed with. Oh, great. Good to see you again. Where are Donald and Goofy? Are they that important to you? More important than old friends? Instead of worrying about them, you should be asking about her. Kyrie! That's right. While you were off goofing around, I finally found her. Not so fast. No shenanigans aboard my vessel, oh, boy. Yeah. Riku, They're teaming up. Why are you siding with the Heartless? The Heartless obey me now, Sora. Oh no. Now I have nothing to fear. Riku, let me fight Sooner you. Sooner or later they'll swallow your heart. Not a chance. My heart's too strong. Riku. I've picked up a few other tricks as well. Like this, for instance. <sighs> oh, what in the name? What? You can go see your friends now. <laughs> Let's get underway already. Huh. And keep Sora away from Kyrie until we're ready to land. Hmm. That scurvy brat thinks he can order me around. What shall we do, Captain Hook? <laughs> Nothing. The hold is crawling with heartless. Let them keep an eye on the brats. But, Captain, you know who is also down. Shh. Did you hear that, me? Oh, that dreadful sound. No, Captain. Are you quite sure? Did I imagine it? Oh, my poor <laughs> nerves. You don't say. Yeah, it was definitely Kyrie. I finally found her. All right. <laughs> yep. Then let's go up and talk to her. Yeah. Sounds great. Okay, but first, how about getting off? <laughs> oh, <laughs> sorry. No, but now I am because I find it was just very weird that you were just awkwardly talking to yourself. Who are you? I'm the answer to your prayers. Yeah. Okay then. Fine. Have it your way. But you're stuck in here too, aren't you? Huh. Nope, I'm just waiting for someone. Who? Yeah, I'm help? rude. What took you so long? Great job. So you found Wendy? 
Hold on. There was another girl there too? Are you crazy? There's no way I'm gonna leave Wendy there. Are you crazy? She must be pretty jealous. <laughs> You're an idiot. That's what. <laughs> Come on, Tink. Open up the door. <clears throat> hmm. I'm Peter Pan. I'm Sora. Okay. We're in this together, but only till we find Wendy. Man. Peter's kind of a jerk. I don't really remember him being that much of a jerk. He's gotta be magic based, so I think swapping Donald for him is a good bet. Alright. Guess we're about to figure that out. Uh. Peter. Uh. All these are those, but. Lord, you glitching out a lot. <laughs> You're an idiot. Oh wait, is that the... what the... Heartless Sora? Like, what's that about? Also... God, I do not like this place already. This is the most awkward camera angle. Um... Let's try not to stay here too long. Fighting. I can't even interact with that. Cringe. Someone, let me out of here. You're cringe. <laughs> that yoinky sploinky. Sorry, bro. Had to do it. Let me up! Okay, so I did have to go in here. <laughs> Weird. But okay. There we go. I'm pretty sure I'm a human. Also, did Peter just cast, like, freeze or something? Like, stop? I think that's what they called it. <laughs> Just stop. <laughs> what do we call the time freezing spell? How about we call it stop? Yeah! I 
kind of just spamming A here. I should probably be a little more careful with what I'm doing, but nah. Ha 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 ha. Oh wow, already another cutscene. So, how come you can fly? Anyone can fly. You want to try? Aw, uh, haven't you cooled off yet, Tink? Just a little bit of pixie dust. There, now you can fly. A little bit of pixie dust. <laughs> Chosen one? There are seven, supposedly. And Maleficent says she's not one of them. Hoist anchor as soon as possible. Leave all the dead weight behind, including her. After the trouble of capturing her? And why those seven? What is Maleficent planning anyway? Who knows? As long as it means getting Kyrie's heart back, I couldn't care less. <laughs> You're wasting your time. The heartless have devoured that girl's heart. I'll stake the oh. other hand, it's lost forever. I will find it, no matter what. Uh, Captain? <laughs> what? The prisoners have escaped. What's more, Peter Pan is with them. Girl, blast that Peter Pan. All right, then. Bring the hostage to me cabin, Smee. Hop to it. I've always loved Smee. What is it, Tink? Peter? <laughs> Peter Pan? Chicken. <laughs> Wendy! <laughs> Wendy! Oh, hey, the pirates are coming! What? I'll be right up there. Just hold on! <laughs> Wendy? Yes? Is there another girl in there with you? Oh, why, yes. But she seems to be asleep. She hasn't budged an inch. Hmm. Kyrie? Kyrie! Huh. Uh. <laughs> Don't get your hopes up. Uh oh. Wendy! Hey, let's get up there! Huh, so she's trying to fight against the Heartless somehow? I'm not sure how that works. Meteor G. If the gummy ship is in uh, Kingdom Hearts 2, then I hope the creation for the gummy ship is better than it was in this game, because it was just very wonky and complicated with how they did everything. Anyways, enough gamer ranting, more gaming, because that's who I am, a gamer. <laughs> oh dear god, just let me climb. sure that'd be correct. Oh, I thought you said there's nobody. Oh. Well, it's hard to tell what you're saying. I mean, you got a TV blaring. You got all this other stuff. I got my TV. Plus, not to mention your earbuds are pretty bad.
this the same place we were in? Okay. <laughs> I see. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Get in, really. I see. Kind of saving at like every opportunity, cause yeah, I thought we could do light green. The heck is this? Are you in there? Okay, so I guess I go through here and go through this area. Drop me, thank you. Okay, and now I'm here again. What the heck, man? Ah! Bunch of babies. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Don't. No. Why are there more?
and that just leads me here. What the heck? Still can't go up there. I'm not even sure why. Because <laughs> I'm an idiot that doesn't know things. Hey, you weren't supposed to agree with that. Pretty dumb. So apparently I do have to... I have to use this, but... Like... From what this guide says, I can use... This trinity. But it's not letting me. I know, right? Oh man. Okay. Good night. I love you too. So I need Donald to activate Trinity. Because of course I can't do cool things with other friends. Okay, bye Donald. <laughs> what? Alright. 
Thanks, buddy. That's why they put the save point there. Because they knew everybody was going to want Peter. Alright. Let's go up. Are we already about to fight Captain Hook? Nope! Whoa! Ah! If I knew there was gonna be a boss here, then I would have equipped the uh, Kingdom Keyblade. Whatever it was called. Oh, he's using arrow. Oh, that's Peter using it. Oh wait, I'm using Fyra. Alrighty then, I guess we're killing a Sora. Jesus! Oh, okay. At this point, he's gonna stall out, uh, Peter, uh, Peter Pan. So, like, he's gonna resurrect sometime soon, maybe. What? Oh, no way, man. Oh, come on. Okay, this time... I'll do this. You know what? I'll go in with Donald instead. I feel like... I'm just one of those people that loves aesthetic, don't mind me. Like, even in Xenoblade, I decided to make sure that their outfits didn't change too much. Because, you know, canon outfits and stuff. I'm that type of person. Is that dumb? Maybe. Do I care? Nah. Pumpkin head. Alright, what am I looking for? Kingdom key. There we go. Ifrit's horn. Lord. Oh, I can't skip these. Okay. So we'll do this. And then I'll save. And then after saving, I'll go up the ladder. Skip. <laughs> 
Using Goofy as a shield, new meta. Okay. Okay, well, Donald's down for the count. Happens to all the magic users. Ooh! Okay. It's pulling fast ones. Crap, Goofy. Jesus! How long does this attack go on for? Stop! Ah, oh, God. It's like he has an immediate counter to every little thing I do. thing at the top corner so I can't see the little microphone thing. Oh, that one was about to attack me. And then its other animation interrupted it. Come on. Jeez, not this one again. was gonna do it. What? They do so much damage with a single hit. Apparently I have to spam dodge. What? Why is he still in the party? What? But I saved with him out of the party. What? Now I gotta do Trinity again. I wonder if they're trying to say... That saving like that is basically worthless. When it comes to that part. I actually have to walk out and walk back in. To create some kind of like auto save or something. There. There, I saved. <laughs> All right. Oh, 
Oh wait, that means I'm still using the pumpkin head. Yeah, trap him in a corner. I can't even see what's happening, but I bet it's dope. Ah, jeez, not this. Where is it? I hope Kingdom Hearts 2 is more combo friendly. Because it's like, in this, I get that same basic combo going, and then it just ends with whenever an enemy feels like ending it. Whenever Sora feels like ending it, which is really early. So it's always the same combo every time. I'll play the running game. I hate it when they get close to walls. I really want that dash to go farther. Oh jeez, it's so awkward. Is this how annoyed the basic enemies get? There we go, baby. Donk! <laughs> oh, that was... Okay, now that one was cool. Hey, Jeb. Good morning, bud. It's not even morning. It's basically 10 p.m., but... Obtained Raven's Claw. Okay. Yay, Dalmatians! Alright, let's see what the Raven's Claw is. Uh, increases strength and defense, but at the cost of 1 AP. Well, if it's hoin, ho hoin? Horn. Probably increases the AP, huh? Yeah. I have to remove an ability. I really don't need guard. I don't even use it. I always roll. this there. Is 
this supposed to be secret shortcut or well I mean I can't seem to open the door so guess we're going through more yep oh okay Wendy not now well this is as far as I can go I gotta help Wendy So no more Peter. Ding ding. Proterra chain. <laughs> Isn't that what I just took off of Goofy? Hunter. Defeat over 2,000 Heartless. Okay. I'm guessing I gotta go the long way around just to get back up. The long way around is this way. I don't think it's even gonna let me go back up. Or go through that one door. Is it? You know, if the camera can work with me. Man, old games are so frustrating. Okay, there were some enemies in here if you return. There we go. Oh. We're having a scrap over here. Sora learned Ripple Drive? Was that what I just read? It went by like an, in like an instant, so... Leave my boy alone. Alone. Oh, now it will. Because I went to the cutscene. Quite a codfish, that Riku. Running off with that girl without even saying goodbye. Run off where? Tell me, where did he go? To the ruins of Hollow Bastion. Where Maleficent oh. resides. Oh. Uh, but... You won't be going there. Uh-oh. Unless you intend to leave your little pixie friend behind. <sighs> Hand over the keyblade and I'll spare your lives. I'm glad I'm merciful, unlike Huntworth. Huh. So which will it be? The keyblade? Or the plank? Sora's never been put in that situation before. So of course he just... ...dropped his keyblade right there. He's after me on the hand! I can't stay here! Go away! Oh, I can't stand the sight of him! Me! You take care of them! What's Smee gonna do? Sora, just believe, and you can do it. It is Neverland. Now it's gonna unlock a team ability or whatever it was. <laughs> Thanks, Peter. Hey, don't mention it. 
You didn't think I'd leave you and Tink behind, did you? Attain the power of healing. Cure has been upgraded to Cura. Okay. Um, alright. Sorry, Donald. <laughs> um... Is it not gonna let me go through items? In Neverland, Sora and his friends can fly while jumping. Press B to fly. Press B to X. Press X to descend. Press B to X? What? Press B to rise and X to descend. You're all going down. <gasps> Whee! <laughs> Oh yeah, baby. Don't give up. Don't give up. Oh, what the? Okay then. Is that you, Smee? Did you finish them off? Aye, nope. Captain. They walked the plane. Every last one of them. Blast <laughs> you! Ready to make a splash, you codfish? Now it's your turn to walk the plank. <laughs> oh yeah.
Oh, what? Did Captain Hook target me? Ah. Uh, I was gonna combo and then heal. Alright, we don't have time for these guys. We've gotta be gamers. Oh, we gotta learn how to fly again. Man, they set us back so far, actually. That's pretty dumb. Well, not that far, but, like, nobody wants to fight like this against basic enemies a second time when they're just trying to fight a boss, you know? I mean, sure, it's, like, free experience, but still, in the end, that's just kind of annoying. Oh, I had to relearn that ability, too. Yeah, I can't reorganize anything right now, either. That sucks. Alright, got him out of here. Who's next? Oh yeah, this dude. Ow. There we go. Whoa! Y'all saw that, right? I was at about half health. And then he did that. What? Okay, interesting. There we go. Defense up. Learn Ripple Drive. Hmm. Just gonna pick up as much stuff as I possibly can. There we go. I know I can't do it, but let's see. Hmm. Huh. What if I remove Strike Raid and put Ripple Drive? <clears throat> Here we go. Uh, 
Leaf Bracers stop enemies from breaking curability on self. Huh. Well, I'm not going to be using Donald. Hmm. I should actually use the summon this time. Okay. Maybe Goofy should actually have items. Goofy. All right. Quite a cod fish. Quite a cod fish. <laughs> Why did I use that right there? Oh, whoa, 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 hey, hey, hey. Lord. Wish I had more long range opportunities that didn't you know, require me to use MP. Instantaneously charges. Alright, let's skip this and actually get into the fight. Alright. Fire! Fire! Bye. <laughs> Summon Bambi. 
Let's see what this one's like. I think this is the first time we're using Bambi. Ah. Oh. Now kill. Oh, he drops magic for me. What a good kid. Okay. Thank you, Peter. Ah, shoot. Let's summon... Simba. Alright. Here he comes, a big man. Some stuff for me. Thank you, Simba. No, I was ah, uh, I was healing. Why did he ignore them both? Seriously pushed through them both and ran directly for me. Oh, that was annoying. Screw you. Give me Ripple. And my defense up. That's so annoying. I knew exactly what to do, too. Oh, and I gotta do everything again. <laughs> I hate this. Alright, take a high potion. Take a high potion. Then... I'll use a potion on myself. Excuse me. What is this do?
Weiter Kopf! Screaming for help. Nice. You really are the, the head of the knights. Head of the king's royal knights. Where is he? There he is. Let's go, Bambi. Need some magic back. Thing. Sora. Sora. Oh, okay, so he has a special ability if you use fire on him. Alright. Man, okay. Things do so much damage in this game. Oh. 
kill on that one. and a high potion and then a potion for Sora and a potion for Goofy and then we go with the same stuff there Goofy, Evolution, and Cheer I don't know if I grabbed everything, but eh, whatever. Alright, give me a moment. I'm gonna grab a drink. Well, I'm not gonna go grab one, but the drink is like sitting right here. You know what I mean. But you won't be going there. Unless you intend to leave your little pixie friend behind. There we go. Uh, oh god, excuse me. <sighs> Wasn't my strongest bird, but you know. Hand over the keyblade and I'll spare your lives. You're all going down. Okay. Oh god, his sail's already gone. Okay, bro, jeez, chill. There we go.
What the? Oh, I thought I was on attack. Used up so much more magic. those little openings. Ursula is still more annoying. <laughs> Ars Arcanum. Ansem's report 9. So, does Ansem have something to do with the creation of the Heartless? I forgot. Couldn't wake up, so maybe she's really lost her. <gasps> Sora, I still can't believe it. It really flew. Wait till I tell Kyrie. I wonder if she'll huh. believe me. Probably not. <laughs> you can Probably bring her not. to Neverland sometime. Then she can try it herself. If you believe, you can do anything, right? I'll find Kyrie. I know I will. There's so much I want to tell her about flying, the pirates, and everything else that's happened. <laughs> What's that thing? What about the clock tower? You say there's something there. Something at the clock tower? Oh, it's her. I thought they were luring me right into another boss fight. I was about to say. <laughs> I was about to fight this game. You'll find her, Sora. Don't, just don't give up. Okay. Huh. So what, do I get to explore the entirety of this place? Nah, no way. Save point. There we go. Is there going to be a keyhole somewhere? Or like, what, what did they want? Ha! 
Okay, it doesn't let me go any further down than that. Is this the only one that's different? It is. Do I have to do something about that? Um... to Big Ben, you can tell the time from anywhere in London, but one of the clocks is off. I hope it doesn't confuse too many people. Would you try striking the hands? I thought I just tried that. The heck? Okay. Now let me hit this one. Up, up. Do I have to get them in the center? Lord, let me just angle this. <laughs> I mean, I'm striking it. There we go. Oh. It has to be all the way up here. Right at the end. There we go. And now a keyhole, right? Right between two and three. Sora? Hmm? Oh, when we grow up, let's get off this island. We'll go on real adventures, not this kid stuff. Sure, but isn't there anything fun? Oh, hey, you know the new girl at the mayor's house? She arrived on the night of the meteor shower. Oh, shoot. It was reckless to bring her here without at least using a vessel. Remember, relying too heavily on the dark powers could cost you your heart. Hmm. A castaway. Though his world perished, his heart did not. When we took the princess from his castle, he apparently followed her here through sheer force of will. But fear not. No harm. Who are we talking about? He is no match for your power. My power? Yes. The untapped power that lies within you. Oh, shoot. Now, child, it's time you awakened that power. And realize your full potential. Melissa, Melissa, Melissa Fent. Maleficent is Snow White, right? Oh God, who's the prince? Peter, are you really going back to Neverland? <sighs> Afraid so, but we can see Shoot. each other anytime, as long as you don't forget about Neverland. That is. 
Is she gonna be a summon? Yep, learn summon spell Tinkerbell. <laughs> Obtained Fairy Harp. And now we can use Glide as a shared ability. Let's go! First of all, yes, I'll save. Second of all, gummy. All right. Achievement: Pixie Dust. Seal the keyhole in Neverland. Well, we found the navy gummy piece. Let's go back to town. Sid'll install it on the ship once we bring it to him. There's a tournament being held at the Coliseum. I hear there's a great reward for the winner. Alright. Alright, let's see what it's all about. Oh, excuse me. Um, very hard. Raises uh, max MP by one and enhances magic and summon power. Sometimes, sometimes deals powerful critical blows. Okay, I'll do it. Looks okay. It's very short range, though. That's the only down uh, downside of it. It'll be great to face you. Oh, am I facing Herc? Ah, shoot. I'm totally facing Herc. Ah, great. Hercules Cup. I didn't equip Glide, so we can't use it. Minions of Horror. Ah, shoot. Buccaneers. What the heck? Huge 
Yuck. Truffle. I don't think I've even faced a rare truffle yet. Oh, you just make him leave. I'm guessing if you kill him, then it gives a ton of experience. Cloud! Uh oh. Um. Not ready. Definitely not ready. Oh, jeez. Yeah, leave me alone. <laughs> Jesus, Cloud. Did he just use Braver? Was that what that was supposed to be? I didn't mean to do that. I just instinctively started mashing A when I got close. Just keep the pressure on him, guys. Thank you, Donald. Ah, oh, God. There we go. Chocobo. I just got a new Keyblade just for beating up Cloud. Okay. I wish. Th I wish there was a Keyblade called Buster. Just so we could have the Buster Sword in some way. And just have it be a thick keyblade. That would have been awesome. I would have loved a gigantic keyblade. Like, not even long, like the Mazamane. Just thickened. Ah, Jesus. Everything's on my tail. Ah! Leave me alone! I was in the middle of a combo- Ah! <laughs> Raining everything down on me. Oh, well. Guilt me last second, bro. I wish I put glide on. Show me what you've got. That's threatening. Hercules, wait. Let's go one on one. Oh, brother, what a show off. What are we gonna do? Let him go alone, I guess. Good luck, sword. 1v1? I'm not gonna go easy on you. No! This wasn't a part of the plan. Uh oh. 
Okay, 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 sorry. Oh, oh. Because knowing my luck, that's gonna be like a one shot kill. Oh, he instantly parries everything when he's like that? Let me pick it up, let me pick it up. You fool! Oh! Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop! Herc, what are you doing? You're actually scaring me! Because I know my luck, and I know that just means insta-kill for some reason. I just feel it in my bones. Not again, not again, not in the corner, not in the corner, not like this. Yes! Oh, I beat Hercules! Let it be known. Whew. Done. Hero of the Colosseum win the Hercules Cup. Goofy obtained Herc's shield. Wow! And I didn't even hold back! Now I finally know what you mean about strength of heart. Mine comes from Donald and Goofy. Come again? If we stick together, we're unbeatable. Not even Hercules stands a chance. With these guys beside me, I'm ready for anything. But that's not exactly of what- Of course. Your friends give you strength. Isn't that right, Phil? The three of you together make great heroes. And as a team, I'm sure you can overcome anything. Let's go. Obtained Olympia. We got so many Keyblades. Learned Yellow Trinity. Well, let's see what it is. We learned how to push. Oh, so that's where that one was hiding. Okay. Well then. things first we're saving because dang I did not expect that to do that in one shot that was awesome all right now that we've done that let's check out our keyblades dude all right what do we check out first metal chocobo 
I has a little uh, Chocobo keychain. I love that. Alright. Rarely deals critical blows. But possesses incredible power and reach. Interesting. I mean, the key is thick. Wait a s- So it is the Buster Sword. It is the Buster so It is! Okay, it has the two Materia slots at the bottom. Okay, sweet, it is Buster Sword. I like that. Olympia. Uh, a powerful weapon that is difficult to deflect, capable of inflicted- of inflicting mighty critical blows. So it's it's just metal chocobo, but better. So, huh? That saddens me then. Well, actually, no. It's better damage-wise, but range. That's where Metal Chocoba wins. Okay. Wow, alright. And... Goofy... Got Herc's Shield... Which buffs his strength up by so much. To 29? Oh, we're vibing. We are vibing, dude. Championship trophy for Herx. Now we're good. Can't be a hero if you don't even try it. Bro, we beat Hercules. I don't want to hear anything. I'm gonna equip Metal Chocobo. I want to carry the Buster Sword one more time. Because I feel like it's gonna be a long time before I ever get a FF7 remake. Someday. Junior Hero. Seal the keyhole in Olympus Coliseum. Sweet. Alright. No! I want it to warp drive. Whew. Saved it. Let's just go to the first district. Okay, maybe now? Nope. Apparently I still don't have any of the secrets. Actually, before we do that... Let's check our journal. We have not done that yet. Uh, Atlantica. Ariel, a princess of Atlantica, yearned to go to other worlds, but her dream could not be realized, as King Triton, her father, forbade such notions. Ursula took advantage of this to coax Ariel into leading her to Triton's trident, uh, which she then seized for herself. To atone for her mistake, Ariel went to Ursula's lair with Sora, Donald, and Goofy to retrieve the trident. After her marais were defeated, Ursula used the trident's power to become a giant, but was vanquished in the end. With the trident's power, uh, Sora found the keyhole and sealed it. Halloween Town Jack, the pumpkin, uh, the pumpkin king of Halloween Town, worked with Dr. Finkelstein 
and created a heart to control the heartless for the Halloween festival. Oogie Boogie, plotting to use the heart to, uh, to take over Halloween Town, had Lock, Shock, and Barrel steal it. When Sora and company arrived at his manor, Oogie Boogie tried to summon a swarm of Heartless with the heart, but failed. Evidently, the heart was incomplete. After Sora and his friends defeated him, Oogie Boogie returned into a, uh, turned into a giant monster, becoming one with his manor. However, he was beaten yet again and disappeared along with the manor. Sora sealed the keyhole in Halloween Town. Neverland Sora and company, trapped inside Hook's ship, searched for Kyrie and Wendy, who were locked away somewhere below deck. When they found them, they learned that something was wrong with Kyrie. She remained dormant, as if she had lost her heart. Just when Sora thought Kyrie was within reach, Riku snatched her away. Sora and the others pursued them to the main deck, where Hook and his men waited. With Peter Pan's help, they defeated the pirates, but Riku and Kyrie were nowhere to be found. For now, Sora could only hope to see her again. When he sealed the keyhole at the clock tower, Sora found the gummy block. Will he be able to find Kyrie again with this new block? With Tinkerbell now in the party, Sora and his friends continued with their journey. Alright, there's our chronicles. Uh, we'll save Ansem's report for last. Characters 2. Ariel. Trident's youngest daughter. Ursula tricked her into helping steal his trident. Uh, with help from Sora and the others, all was put right. Still, she'll never stop dreaming of exploring the world outside her father's palace. Her voice enchanted us in The Little Mermaid, 1989. Ursula. She deceived Ariel and stole the trident to take over Atlantica. Uh... Using its power, she became an enormous monster and battled Sora, Goofy, and Donald. She appeared in The Little Mermaid, 1989. Uh, Jetsam, Ursula's lackey, along with Flotsam. Uh, an evil moray eel, Jetsam is a smooth talker who loves to deceive. His specialty is using empty promises to lure unsuspecting mermen and mermaids to Ursula's clutches. He ran interference for Ursula in The Little Mermaid. Flotsam! Ursula's lackey, along with Jetsam. An evil moray eel, Flotsam is a smooth talker who loves to deceive. His specialty is using empty promises. It's literally the same thing, so... Basically, they're trying to say... Same personality. They didn't feel like coming up with anything new for them. Jack Skellington. The Pumpkin King. He loves to scare people out of their wits. Headstrong, confident, and likes grand gestures. Now he's working night and day to make this year's Halloween festival the greatest ever. He scared up some fun in Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas, 1993. Sally. Dr. Finkelstein's creation. She's patched together from parts that sometimes come off and move about on their own. She loves Jack and tries to steer him in the right direction, though it doesn't always work. She appeared in Nightmare Before Christmas. Oogie Boogie, the villain who tried to take over Halloween Town. The heart he stole from Dr. Finkelstein. Uh, Fink... The heart he stole from Dr. Finkelstein attracted the Heartless, and the result was his doom. He came apart at the seams in the nightmare before Christmas. Dr. Finkelstein, the mad scientist who created a heart to help Jack control the Heartless's dancing. Sally is another one of his creations. She helps him around the lab, but she'd much rather spend time with Jack. He created some scares in the nightmare before Christmas. Zero. Jack's ghost dog. He comes out of his grave whenever Jack calls. He is very loyal to his master and loves it when Jack plays with him. He loyally followed Jack in The Nightmare Before Christmas. Locke. Oh boy. The ringleader of the trio that includes Shock and Barrel. 
Uh, their walking bathtub helps them get around while they commit all kinds of mischief. They sometimes help, help, help Oogie, but they're not really fond of him. He, he created havoc in The Nightmare Before Christmas. Shock! Along with Lock and Barrel, she's part of uh, Oogie Boogie's plot to take over Halloween Town. Shock is the most cunning member of the trio. She keeps her cool when the other two are losing it. She created havoc in Nightmare Before Christmas. Barrel, a member of the trio that includes Lock and Shock. He's a little slow and often ends uh, and often ends up as the butt of his partners' his pranks and practical jokes. Nightmare Before Christmas, you know the deal. The mayor, the two-faced mayor of Halloween Town. He switches from his happy face to his sad face depending on his mood, which changes constantly. He's working with Jack to make this year's festival the best ever. Nightmare Before Christmas. Peter Pan! The flying boy from Neverland, who, uh, where no one ever grows up. He can be stubborn, but he's also fearless and has a strong sense of justice. He snuck on board Hook's ship to rescue Wendy, who was kidnapped. He was led... He led the Lost Boys in Peter Pan, 1953. Tinkerbell. The little pixie from Neverland, Peter Pan asked her to accompany Sora and friends on their quest, but she's anxious to see Peter. She can restore party's HP and prevents Sora from being defeated, though only once. Costs 3 MP. She made us believe in fairies in Peter Pan. Wendy, a dreamy girl who... Uh, whose wish to visit Neverland came true. Uh, Peter Pan showed her the way, but she got caught up in Hook's vendetta against Peter and was kidnapped by Hook. Uh, she watched over the Lost Boys and Peter Pan. Captain Hook, the pirate with a grudge against Peter Pan who caused him to lose his hand to the crocodile. He threw in his lot with Maleficent and the Heartless, but ended up being chased over the horizon by the crocodile. He hooked us in Peter Pan. Mr. Smee, Hook's first mate. He lives to take orders from Hook, but he's as slow-witted as Hook is obnoxious. <laughs> the Crocodile. A seagoing reptile big enough to swallow a man whole, and he's always hungry. He's got a taste, uh, he got a taste of Hook once and never forgot it. Hook can tell when he's near, uh, near by the sound of the clock ticking away in his stomach. Uh, he had the taste for Captain Hook and Peter Pan. The Heartless. Aqua Tank. Heartless resembling a fish that calmly swim the seas. They are often carrying screwdrivers, leisurely, uh, leisurely large creatures that do not attack unless provoked. White White Knight. That's a Okay. Uh Heartless that mostly uh appear in Halloween Town. Their jerky dance like attack Wait, their jerky dance like attack moves are fairly easy to dodge but cause large damage. Gargoyle. Winged Heartless that mostly appear in Halloween Town. They can move from one place to another almost without notice. Since they are prone to sneak attack, they often get caught off the, uh, guard by counterattacks. Pirate. Heartless that mostly appear in Neverland. They are quite uh, combative with their swords. They often just focus on the enemies in front, making them vulnerable to attacks from behind. Air Pirate. Winged Heartless that mostly appear in Neverland. They're extremely combative and are hardly ever caught off guard. They attack with martial art, uh, martial arts-like techniques. Battleship, heartless that fuse together with a pirate ship. They attack with homing and magic protect projectiles. Attack them at close range. Uh, it's not. Gonna show me the weird heartless Sora? Okay. Ansem's report. Okay, we're all over the place. Number three. The shadows that crawl beneath the castle. Are they the people who lost their hearts or incarnations of darkness? 
or something entirely beyond imagination. All my knowledge has provided no answer. One thing I am sure of is that they are entirely devoid of emotion. Perhaps further study will unlock the mysteries of the heart. Fortunately, there is no shortage of test samples. They are multiplying underground even as I write this report. They still need a name. Those who lack hearts, I will call them the heartless. Number 7. I am now studying material from the meteors that rained down that fateful night. What a find! The material is foreign to our world. It is elastic to the touch, and when two pieces are combined, they bond easily. None of the records I've scoured even mention such a substance. Was it introduced to this world when I opened that door? I wonder how many other such materials drift through the atmosphere of this tiny world. I wish I could soar off and find out. I think the hooded guy is handsome. Could there be uncharted worlds up there? My curiosity never ceases to grow. But I should stop speaking of such unrealistic dreams. For now, there is no way to venture outside this world. My people and I are all but prisoners of this tiny place. Ansem's Report 9 Simply astonishing! Today I had a guest from another world. He is a king, and his vessel is built of the material that composed the meteors. He called the pieces gummy blocks. It seems that my, op that my opening that door has opened a path to interworld travel. We talked for countless hours, but one story in particular caught my interest. That, that of a key called the Keyblade. The Keyblade is said to hold phenomenal power. One legend says its wielder saved the world, while another says he wrought chaos and ruin upon it. I must know what this Keyblade is. A key opens doors. It must be connected to the door that I have opened. Okay, so Ansem found Mickey after opening the door in, uh, shoot, what's the place called? After opening the door in, Destiny Islands. That's what it's called, right? Yep, Destiny Islands. So, that's interesting. Okay. Huh. Uh, where did Sid say he'd be? Geppetto? Oh, he moved here. Pinocchio. Hey, it's Sora. Oh, hello, Sora. How did you get here? A man named Leon helped us. He even got us this house to live in. I don't know how I'll ever repay his kindness. Say, here you three are fighting the Heartless. I thought I might be able to help you, so I made this. Obtain Geppetto. <laughs> For us? But of course, Pinocchio and I can't thank you enough. We'll do anything we can to help you. I hope the attack is like Pinocchio tells like a million lies and beats someone to death with his nose. Also, we just got something called Wishing Star? Huh. Has a short reach but always finishes up a combo attack with a powerful critical blow. Interesting. I mean, I'm... Still gonna go with my metal chocobo, but still. I like it. Soda. I've been sitting in the floor for a while. I'm gonna get up on my bed. Do do do. Also, I'm gonna turn this fan down so I'm not getting too cold. 
Right. Wait, no, I was going the right way. Why did I go over here? Just like went to Geppetto's house and dipped. Hey, you got another navigation gummy there, eh? I'll bet you want it installed. Yeah, please. Okay, we're here. We'll get it installed right now. Now, just remember what Donald said to you. No frowning, no sad faces. Oh. How can you be so cheerful? There's still no sign of your king. Aren't you worried? I'm going. The king told us to go out and find the key bearer, and we found you. So as long as we stick together, it'll all work out okay. You just gotta believe in yourself, that's all. Just believe. I believe in you. People lived in peace, bathed in the warmth of light. Everyone loved the light. Then people began to fight over it. They wanted to keep it for themselves. And darkness was born in their hearts. The darkness spread, swallowing the light in many people's hearts. It covered everything, and the world disappeared. But small fragments of light survived in the hearts of children. With these fragments of light, children rebuilt the lost world. It's the world we live in now. But the true light sleeps deep within the darkness. That's why the worlds are still scattered. And divided from each other. But someday a door to the innermost darkness will open. And the true light will return. So listen, child. Even in the deepest darkness, there will always be a light to guide you. What the... Believe in the light and the darkness will never defeat you. Your heart will shine in with its power and push the darkness away. Do you understand, Kyrie? Kyrie? the matter? Um, nothing. Kyrie, did you call me? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> I installed that navigation gummy. But you know, that place is crawling with Heartless. Don't say I didn't warn you. Here, take this along. Transform G. Cool. Empty. Oh yeah, I already looted that. Oops. still heartless here. I thought I sealed this place.
Oh wait, it's this way. The only part of this game that I don't like. Platforming. I mean, there's some other aspects that I don't really enjoy about this game. I don't know. Th this game, I have a hard time keeping my attention on it. It just... I don't know. It's just very weird to me. Alright, let's get this lady out here. Alright. She's just worried about Cinderella. Boo, moving on. Alright, where's the book? Where the heck did the book go? Aha. Uh -huh. Have to go through all those awkward camera angles. We did that. I think this is new. Mithril shard. What? Not new. This one I have a torn page. Yeah, try reattaching it. How do I reattach them again? Yeah, I just can't use it. What? Okay then, I guess I can't reattach this page? I'm trying to go to all the marked out areas. Here we go, here's something new. Maybe because I didn't check this out, it's not gonna... It wasn't gonna let me, you know, move on. Um... I'm 
I'm just gonna pull all of these out. Just in case there's like some kind of weird achievement. Because that's the type of person I am. Bye bye forever, pumpkins. What am I doing? I think it's about time I ask myself that question. Just, what am I doing? <laughs> In general, bro. Potion. Do I have to get the carrots and everything too? No, I can't even get them. <laughs> okay, carrots are lucky. There's a letter inside. I hope we'll be finding more honey together soon. Always home, and I'm out of honey. Huh. <laughs> rabbit's house. Look, rabbit's house came back. But it looks like Rabbit isn't home. Pooh's been calling and calling, but the house says no one's there. Nobody's home. That's right, nobody. <laughs> Who is this person named Nobody? Nobody, have you seen Rabbit? No, no rabbit here. There's no one here. Hello, rabbit. <laughs> why, Poe? Uh oh, why, Poe? What a pleasant surprise. <laughs> Is this still going? Still going good? Alright, yep. Sweet. Still going strong. Alright. Alright. And nice to see you too, Piglet. And... Is this a new friend? Pooh, I'm sorry, but... I'm all out of honey at the moment. Sora, do you smell honey? Oh boy. Is this just like a drug bust? <laughs> Don't waste your time looking around! Honey, now how did that get up there? Would you like some poo? Don't feel you have to, of course. Well, thank you, Rabbit. I would like just a small smack roll. I'm quite hungry. Oh boy. I'm um, Pooh Bear. You're not eating the whole pot, are you? Once you start, there's no stopping you, is there? Glad to have found both rabbit and some honey. <laughs> ah, have honey again. So I guess that's this. I guess I'm done with this part. Like that's okay. Hit <laughs> carrots.
Please help poo. Oh. What the? No oh, help and bother, I'm stuck again. I came in through this hole, so it must have shrunk. Okay. Oh, what to do? He's not going to say anything new. How will I eat honey if I'm stuck here? When it's lunch time, perhaps you could bring me a honey jar? No honey till you're unstuck. If Pooh doesn't slim down, my house will stay plugged up forever. If only there was something we could do. Wait, I know. A bit of carrot top juice will do the trick. If I... I have a carrot patch on the other side of the stream. Carrot top juice is just the ticket to slimming down a poo. Oh no! Oh no. Yep. T-I-double-go-er, that spells Tigger. Well now, I don't think I've ever seen you before. Hello, Tigger. You've just bounced my new friend, Sora. Hey, Pooh. Say, you're looking mighty uncomfy today. Is that some new exercise? Why, bouncing around is a lot more fun. <sighs> Why do you bounce around so much, Tigger? Why? Because bounce is what Tigger's do best! Speaking of which, my bouncing spot has gone and disappeared! Hmm. So for now, this will be my new bouncing ground! <laughs> oh boy. Tigger's bouncing will ruin my vegetables. If we don't give Pooh some carrot top juice, he'll be stuck forever. Please help me keep Tigger away from my carrot. <sighs> Side quest. I mean, sure, I know it's like main story stuff. So I can find the keyhole of this place if there is a keyhole. But, like, God, this just sounds like an excuse to give me a side quest. This is quite a fix, but I have just the solution. Pay attention now. Is that owl? Yeah. Sora, you'll have to protect this carrot patch. If Tigger bounces on a carrot twice, it'll be buried. Once. Twice. Just like that. Protect the carrots from Tigger's bounces and you'll receive points. How you ask, it's elementary. Simply get to the carrots before Tigger lands on them. There are 15 carrots here, your score depends on how many you save and how many times you block Tigger. Oh, and one more thing. The rush command is the key to a high score. Select Rush while near a carrot that isn't buried yet. You'll dash to the target area before Tigger lands. Well, good luck. Great. Alright.
Sora. Is he just gonna camp on this one? <sighs> no. I don't think he completely buried any of them. Sweet. Oh, what's going on? Nobody keeps up with tiggers. Hmm. Maybe there's something wrong with my tail. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now I'd better make that carrot top juice. I'll get the carrots, so please wait inside the house. Oh, what a day. I gave Pooh the carrot top juice. All we have to do now is push him out. Just a little push should do. Uh oh. First my vegetable patch and now this. Oh, oh bother. Oh, where am I? It's ever so dark in here. Well, it isn't so bad, I suppose. <laughs> there is plenty of honey. <laughs> Another secret stash. Oh my god. The torn page turned into a new item. Mithril shard. So that... Alright. That was the page. Now I used it up.
Alright. Let's get a save point first. This is not the save area. Here we go. Traces of fire. Uh, fire. fire? Burning brightly. Okay. Oh, wait. Do I have to go upstairs now? I forgot there was a ladder here. Okay. Still don't see what catching that on fire did for us. Like, is there a chimney or something that's important? Or like, got a postcard. I mean, this thing doesn't want me on the chimney. Ah. <laughs> that was actually pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Alright, let's head on to the new world. Hold on, Donald. We don't know what's out there. Sure, we'll find some new items. Find some new items where? Why don't we revisit other worlds? Oh, uh, because of the different trinities that I got. Or does it mean that? Would they still be informing me? Because there was space for another trophy, so I'm willing to bet there's like some sort of advanced one. So I wonder if they'd inform me of that, or if I have to find that out myself. And that's why they said they wanted me to go search around. Because there's secrets and stuff. Phil said he was getting soft. So, you got any secrets for me? 
No? Aw, oh, don't tell me that's it. There's clearly room for one more. Cringe. Cringe. Okay, I'll go to Neverland and get out of here. Let's see what's going on. Okay, so they're definitely saying that we're heading right into the, f the final world. Like, no way that's not it. Everything with Riku and Kairi is coming to a climax, like... Okay. That, that one just wouldn't die. Also, this music is getting intensified and everything. So, like... Yeah, that's awesome. scary stuff. There we go. And this is it. The Hollow Bastion. Gorsh, look at that. I know this place. Hollow Bastion. Oh, wait, they weren't talking about <laughs> some stupid prince or whatever from... <sighs> nah. They were talking about King Mickey. Mickey's stepping up right now. He's gonna try fighting Maleficent all on his own. Oh, that's strange. I wonder why. I feel this warmth inside me. Right here. Hey, I'm serious. Let's go. And what if I told you that this is where we're ending off this stream.
this episode. I see things are gonna get climactic here. Oops. And I... And I just think it would be a little awkward. Like, awkward spacing and everything. To have... The entirety of Neverland and everything. And, you know, stuff like that. The Acre Woods. You know, and doing all the minor stuff to prepare me for all this. I feel like it'd be a little weird to combine the finale with that. So, we'll end it. So thank you for watching, and next time... We're probably beating this game. We're gonna see Mickey again. We're gonna probably have a showdown with Riku and Maleficent. We're gonna get Kairi back. I think, I hope. And... That'll be it, I think. Unless there's some extra stuff for like a post game or something cuz like there could be secret bosses cuz it's square enix of course there could be secret bosses anyways thank you for watching gonna be cool. Alright. See ya.